Around 50 anti-vaccine protesters shouted slogans and burned face masks in Johannesburg on Wednesday, July 1st, a week after the start of Africa's first human trial of vaccine against COVID-19. I'm not happy at all. I'm not happy at all. I mean, this feels like 1981 all over again, or in the 1980s all over again, when the AIDS pandemic just broke out in SA. It feels like the same thing. It's like, it's like a replay, but this time they're doing it in our face. The vaccine is being tested by Britain's Oxford University with local partner, the University of Witwatersrand. But the trial, consisting of 2,000 volunteers in South Africa, has also prompted a fresh wave of anti-vaccine sentiment, reflecting fears of Africans being used as guinea pigs. Community activist Walter Mashilo said the vaccine should first be tested on lawmakers and ministers' children before being used on poor people. We want them to be in forefront of testing this vaccine to show leadership. South Africa, which has the highest rate of infections on the continent, is the second country outside the UK to take part in the trial after Brazil. The vaccine was developed by Oxford University scientists who are now working with AstraZeneca on development and production. It's hoped that the involvement of South Africa will ensure Africa has access to an affordable vaccine and is not left at the back of the queue.